the ocean waves, life was no longer so jolly. Our situation report is becoming very, very choppy, so we've had to reduce our speed by 10 knots or so. And on top of that, the Dakar seats weren't really helping. Ah! Meanwhile, in the Daytona... was broken, I was broken, and the rough seas had forced us down to 25 knots, which meant that Hammond would be roaring ahead. God, how much further is it? About 100 nautical miles. Oh, marvellous. I was indeed ahead, and as I neared the French border, I was now so in love with the Daytona that I might have been babbling a bit. Everything that it was, it still is. And when you drive one here, doing this, the mechanical interface between you and it, it does take you into it. Mercifully, my doe-eyed dribbling was then cut short. Oh, I think we've just been pulled by the police. Ah, now he's... Ah, oh, yes. He's waving his arm at the cameraman. Uh, I think the rest of this film may not look as good as the first bit. I'm in Daytona and I'm wearing shades, so I'm absolutely fine. Despite Hammond's setback, we had to keep going as fast as our spines would allow if we were to stay in the race. We are back up to 41, 42 knots, which is on the twice as fast as we were going for half an hour. Yeah, it's much better than a Max Mosley party. Shades haven't worked. The Italian police weren't convinced that we had rightful possession of the Daytona. He wants the documents for the car. Documents for the car. Um, sort of no, I don't have them. 77 miles to go. How do we know when we're in France? Um, Does the sea become even rougher, like the roads do? Whoa, this is enormous! Ah! This was bad. My lead was now being destroyed. Right, I'll go and sort this out. told us to follow them to the police station. Out on the sea, my body may have been taking a battering, but at least I didn't have to worry about the rosers. Hey, the police. Police. Is that That's the police? police? Yeah. Oh, God, he wants to see documents. Hello. Hello, how are you? I've been stopped by the police. You haven't? <laughs> Yeah, the sea police. You know the, the Riviera thing? The Grand Tour? Yeah. It's not yeah. what it was, is it? No. no. It's not all Sophia Lola Brigida anymore. If there's more paperwork involved than Bridget Bardot would have sort of been doing and does. Finally, we were both released. Right. Saint Tropez. But because the police had stopped Hammond for much longer, I had now closed the gap. Uh, we are now going past Monaco, oh, which is on the right. 50 nautical miles to go. It's anybody's race. But then, at motorway speeds, it soon started to go my way again. A final stretch of motorway down to Saint Tropez. And I'm over dry. I am probably the most low rent, low brow. Chavy urchin ever to pedal one of these along the Riviera. Over 50 knots. Yep.
With a considerable lead over James, I was now off the motorway, on the A road, and just 20 odd miles from Saint Tropez. This is where the car just comes alive now. Yes, it's not a nimble, tiny, lightweight sports car, but it feels live, supple. And now, to complete a truly excellent day, I shall win the race in the Daytona, have a little gloat, and then I think a beer. Blister, 55, 7, 60 knots there. I was getting really close to Saint-Tropez. Land of glamour, here I come. Any minute, the Daytona would be back in the world of Mick and Bianca, where it belongs. I was now entering the fabled town itself. Yeah, some of the signs and advertising hoardings have got a bit bigger, but, you know, modern world. OK, this is getting a bit snarly now, but... Fair dues. So there's another bit of land you can see to the left. Yeah. Head for that now. As James powered on, I was discovering that Saint Tropez wasn't quite what I imagined. Oh no, this isn't right. Holiday homes for sale, burgers, traffic. The car's still brilliant, but the world's changed. I was just 15 miles from the finish line. Well, 15 miles at 45 knots is uh, 20 minutes. Mini golf. If this car overheats, but it will, it's old and Italian. On HMS Carbon Kazi, we were flying. 61, hey, 65. Well, hey, 2.5 miles to run. As I got closer to the center of Saint Tropez, the traffic started moving again, and I was heading for the finish line, a bar in the port. Speed humps. Speed humps in a Ferrari Daytona. That's not right. Less than a mile. Beer, beer. Got to be close now. Sorry, everybody, about the car. He's not here. Oh, hang on. I... Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. It's a pleasure to win. Do you know what? Well, I don't care. Because I great. said it was the perfect vehicle for the job. I didn't say fastest. I said perfect, and it was. I mean, look at it here. It's just, look at them it's all over it. It's beautiful. Tell me you don't agree. Bloody gorgeous. <laughs> Something I want to ask you. What? Can I drive the car back? I'm broken. Please. Yes. 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 